welcome to the first vlog of 2021. Very exciting. We're starting off the new year right. I'm feeling productive. I'm feeling motivated. Today is Tuesday, January 5th. I've been staying at my parents' house since like mid-December just for the holidays. It's been so nice to just relax and spend time with them. But I just got back to my apartment yesterday and I am trying to get back into like my normal routine. So that's kind of going to be what this vlog is. It's just like getting my life together, starting the new year off right. So I went to Trader Joe's this morning because I didn't have any food since I haven't been staying here. So we did a full stock up. So I'm going to show you guys what I got. One of my goals for 2021 is to be really good about planning out my meals and getting everything that I need at the grocery store so that I don't end up eating out too much. I'll put my meal plan for this week on the screen right now. I just write it out in my notes app. I have like an ongoing list of meal ideas for like breakfast, lunches, and dinners. And I just kind of pick and choose from that what I want to eat that week. I'm also going to start getting HelloFresh again this week. That'll be good. So that's two dinners a week. And then I just kind of have to figure out the other days. So let's do a Trader Joe's haul. Before I show you guys what I got from Trader Joe's, I wanted to take a second to talk to you about Skillshare and thank them for sponsoring today's video. It's kind of the perfect sponsor for the first vlog of the new year because if any of you guys are looking to learn a new skill or pursue a creative passion in the new year, Skillshare can definitely help in doing that. If you aren't already familiar with Skillshare, it is an online learning platform with thousands of classes in different creative fields. It allows you to explore different interests and take classes classes in a ton of different topics such as photography, graphic design, music production, and so many more. The class I'm taking right now is on productivity. It's called Productivity Masterclass Principles and Tools to Boost Your Productivity. It's taught by Ali Abdal and I thought it was the perfect class to start off the new year with and just get myself into a productive mindset. Skillshare offers membership with meaning so you can connect with a community of other creative people and help to inspire one another. You can also take classes completely at your own pace on your own schedule so if you've been wanting to pursue a creative passion now is the time. If you want to give Skillshare a try the first 1,000 people to click the link in my description box will get a free trial of Skillshare premium membership and after that it's only around $10 a month so definitely check it out take advantage of that offer and thank you again to Skillshare for sponsoring today's video now on with the Trader Joe's haul here is everything we'll start over here so for dinner tonight actually I want to try to make this Asian chicken lettuce wrap recipe so I got some things for that we got this sweet chili sauce sesame oil rice vinegar I got another box of couscous my favorite gnocchi this is like a good lazy dinner if I don't feel like making anything it's just frozen and you just like heat it up in a pan and it's so good I got some chicken tenders and then also ground chicken for the lettuce wraps tonight some like snacky things we got dried mango this little like nuts and dried banana mix pita chips white cheddar popcorn then moving on to like produce stuff i got some salad mix and romaine hearts apples avocados carrot slices to have as a snack with some dips that i got i got these gluten-free everything bagels to try out i've never tried trader joe's gluten-free bagels but they could be good. Also, I have my new air fryer here. If you watched my what I got for Christmas, this was like my big gift. So it like folds up. I'll show you when all this is out, how it like pops out, but it also is a toaster so I can toast my bagels in it. Then I got a red pepper, yellow onion, red onion, garlic, limes, ginger, bananas, blueberries, I'm going to make overnight oats tonight. I've been needing to do this. I always just buy overnight oats at Trader Joe's, but tonight I'm gonna try to like meal prep and make my own. So I'm gonna like top them with blueberries. I pretty much already had all of the ingredients for that, just not like the fresh fruit. So that should be really easy. I'll show you guys that. I got some pineapple slices just for like a snack. Cucumbers, peanut butter, this coconut and almond coffee creamer, some onion and chive cream cheese for my bagels. I got four of these almond yogurts. They're the vanilla flavor. These are so good. I wish they came in like one big tub so I didn't have to buy all the individual ones. Maybe they'll come out with that someday. Then I just got spicy hummus dip, this buffalo chicken dip, so good. Some feta cheese slices, and then I just got this salad to have for lunch today actually. I thought it sounded really good. Also got this kombucha that I'm drinking right now. So that is everything. I'm going to put all this away and eat my salad. Here's 
here's the air fryer it folds up like this when you're not using it to like save counter space and then when you are using it pull it down and there it is this thing does everything it air fries roasts broils bakes dehydrates i've been really running low on space in my apartment lately i need to do like a full organizing like day or multiple days and just like get rid of stuff um in all of my drawers and like closets and stuff that's a project for another time but i bought these two little command strip hooks i already have these in my bedroom i used to keep my bags on these but then for the winter i had nowhere to put my winter coats so i've been hanging my coats on those now so i bought two more of these this is my front door this is my little like entryway i guess but I have this whole wall here, so I'm gonna hang them here and do like one here, one here, like off center. Then hang all of my like nicer bags here. The ones that like aren't as nice, I have a little like tub in my closet and I just throw them in there. But I don't wanna put my like nice bags in there, so I'm gonna hang them here. I wanted to show you guys i just got the our place always pan i'm opening it up now it comes with a sponge for cleaning that's cool here's the lid i got it in the like charcoaly gray color i've heard so many people rave about this it's basically one pan that's like meant to replace all of your other pans i'm gonna test it out for a few days and then hopefully if i like it i can clean out this drawer a little bit and maybe get rid of some pots and pans and then Let's see nesting steamer cute you like turn some lights on i've heard that the inside is like very non-stick so we'll have to put this to the test tonight i can use it to make my chicken for my lettuce wraps and then it also comes with a little like spatula thing it's just like sticks on there i think wait this way there it is later on in the evening and i'm gonna start making my dinner so like i said earlier i'm making asian chicken lettuce wraps i will link the recipe that i'm using down below i'm leaving out like two ingredients for the sauce because i just don't have them and i couldn't find them at trader joe's so hopefully it doesn't ruin the recipe i'm sure will be fine this recipe serves six people i think i'm gonna cut it in half and make three servings and have leftovers for the next few days because it'll be really easy to reheat. So let's get to cooking.
go to bed tonight, I'm just going to make my overnight oats. I'm gonna make two servings so I can have one for breakfast tomorrow and then one another day this week. So this is my first time making them, but it should only take like a minute to make and looks really easy. So I got these little containers from Target the other day. I thought they were like the perfect size overnight oats and then for ingredients i'm just gonna use oats i'm gonna use oat milk but you can use any milk that you want um cinnamon nut butter you can use like peanut butter almond butter whatever but i'm gonna use this trader joe's mixed one chia seeds and then if you want you can top them with any fruit or frozen fruit so i'm just gonna use blueberries and i'll leave the recipe for this that i'm following as well down below 